Charlie's gonna build a brand new base for you today And I hope you're ready to play I promise that we're gonna have a lot of fun And I promise you that when we are done You will be happy <laughs> What's up guys? I don't know why I did that But I wanted to play the guitar for y'all um, I've done it once before in a video, but blah, blah, blah. Guess what? Today, new video, bass build, Town Hall 9, trophy bass. Let's do it. All right? So we are going to go right up here, and we are going to remove all. There we go. All right, now I got my bass design up here on my computer so I can look at it while I'm doing this. Um, but I wanted to build a trophy bass for you guys for Town Hall 9, obviously. Um, so that is what we are going to do. How does that sound? Great. I'm happy that it sounds awesome to you guys. <laughs> um, all right, so let's go ahead and bring that out. Let's grab our Expos. Um, my farming base so far has worked pretty well. Um, I've liked it a lot. Yeah, okay, so this goes right here. I've liked my farming base a lot. Um, I haven't really run into too many problems with it or anything like that but um, right now obviously I am just setting up my expos in the center of the base let's grab our clan castle I never know where anything is on this thing oh it's kind of annoying um, where's my clan castle guys where oh, okay clan castle right there okay awesome and then let's go Tesla Tesla I think that needs to be over up one. Yeah, there we go. Nope. I don't think that's right. We'll make it right, whatever. And then mortar right here. Yeah, so this needs to be, these need to be right here by the mortar. Um, guys, I'm calling this base design the spaceship design because for some reason I feel like it looks like a spaceship to me. Alright, so that's why we're calling it the spaceship design. You'll see why in a second. Um, let me make sure everything looks right. It's weird because at this angle it looks different from what it does over on the other side um, of my screen. So we're going to bring this little guy right here. There we go. And let's bring this other one out. Put him up one. There we go. And then now we are going to start with our walls. Where are our walls at? There we go. All right, so we got the big boy walls right here. Bring this down all the way to there, over, down past that. And we're going to go down one more. Come on. Yeah, there we go. All the way over to there. Down one, and then all the way down to there, and then down past that, and one more down. Here we go. All right, and repeat yourself. Nope. Don't want that. Remove. Scoot this over. Inward and up. No, I'm not trying to do that. All I want to do is zoom in. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Come on! Oh my gosh, really? That's what you're doing? That's not at all what, I'm sorry. That's not at all what I told to do. <laughs> um, Alright, so we go past it. And then we come in one. Man, this is the most trouble that I've ever freaking had with walls before. And then all the way over. Alright, I'm off somewhere. Why am I off? I've got no idea why this is off. Is this one over here off? No. Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm just freaking out for no reason. No, that's definitely off. What am I messing up here? That's in there. That's in there. All right. Hidden Tesla right there. Oh. Wow, Molt. Wow, Molt. All right, there we go. Nope, don't want to look in there. But I think this guy's supposed to be out one more, actually. Yeah, and then this needs to come in. 
This needs to come in and we need to remove that one. There we go. So that's why I'm calling it the spaceship because that right there kind of looks like a spaceship, if you ask me. Um, wow, we need to get a move on. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and bring out our air defenses. One, two, three, and four. And let's place all of these. So we're going to place one air defense right here and one air defense right here and one air defense right there and then one air defense right over here. It'd be pretty sweet if Clash of Clans lets you uh, like build it online and then just sync it to your to your device, that would be dope. But that's not gonna happen. Um, all right, let's pull this out. Go over here, one more, all the way up there. All right, sweet. Pull this out to here, all the way over there, all the way over there. All right, good, so we're done with that. And now we gotta bring out the wizard tower right there. And then let's bring out the mortar, which is going to go one up from it. Right there, and then we got this right here. So we're going to bring this one over as well. Uh, how's that looking? Yeah, that looks right. And then, so this goes right in there. And that little nook, come on, get in there. There you go. And our other mortars. So right now, as you can see, our mortars are triangulated and our air defenses are in um, a sort of a rectangle, if you will, around the base. Now, I haven't used this base yet. Obviously, it's the first time that I'm building it and applying it in the game. Uh, but I'm excited about it because uh, I think that it's going to work pretty well. And obviously, we will see how it goes from here. Let's go ahead and bring out this bomb right here um, and bring out this bomb right here as well. And now we are going to build out these walls. Wait, why can I not? Why can I not do the... Oh, because <laughs> I'm all out of them. Sweet, I didn't know that I was going to fill my core up perfectly with those. Awesome. Um, all right, so now we're just going to work our way around everything that we just built. And that doesn't seem correct. But it is. Alright, there we go. Build all the way down here, all the way right here, and then back to the back corner right there. And then bring this one out right here. Build all the way to there, here, over in front. Come on. There we go. No, stop it. It's like you can't even touch close to it or else it's going to make walls that you don't want. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, how's that look? That looks right. Yes, okay, now it looks like Batman. Look at that. Sweet. I didn't know that when I was making it. Um, so now in the back, guys, uh, I've noticed a lot of like Hog Rider attacks at this level. Um, so I'm keeping my wizards together in the back of the base to help protect against that and really just mass troops from the top of the base. Just because you tend to get that a lot, and I'm not trying to deal with that. You know what I'm saying? So this is where we're at. That's why those are like that. So you have that little arc of, uh, of wizards in the back, which is awesome. Uh, I think that's going to work really, really well for me. Um, let's go ahead and bring out our... Uh, let's finish building the top of the base. So we're going to bring out our Barbarian King right up here. You know what, I might want to um, relocate them. Yeah, let's do Barbarian King right here, and then Archer Queen right here. Doing this on the fly for you guys. <laughs> Alright, let's go find our Archer Towers. One Archer Tower, two Archer Towers. Alright, good. And then Mr. Cannon, you, my friend, are going to be centered right up there. And now let's build these out. <clears throat> And let's build this out to here, and then all the way down. Good. Build this over. Um, and what I'm doing, guys, is I'm just spreading out my defenses all along the base, obviously, to make it as secure as possible. And I'm also adding a lot of... I know you guys are going to say, Mo, you got too many T-joints. But you know what? Um, the wall breakers, like I'm adding so many sections to this, and I'm really not too... 
afraid of wall breakers getting all the way into the center. Um, they might. I mean, that's their job. You can't really help that. But I think this layout's going to work well, and I'm, I'm really excited to show it to you guys once uh, once it's all done and I have some attacks. Again, guys, this is this is fun for me. I like building... Um, I like building bases. I'm not trying to copy anybody else's base, even if it works, because that's not really that fun for me. <laughs> I would rather build my own base um, and have you guys see it, use it if you want to, whatever. Um, that's always been fun for me. I've attacked my base designs multiple times before, and it's really, really cool uh, seeing that as um, as somebody who likes building bases. Um, it's really cool to see somebody else using your base design and uh, and knowing the secrets of it so that I can win. Uh, that's always fun. Um, all right, so let's bring these archers in here. Other archer right over here. Yep, so we're protecting these points right here. Um, and now let's bring in... Yeah, you're going to go right there and right here. And then we're going to bring our gold storage right back in there. And then we're going to bring out another archer tower right here beside that. Yep, there we go. And let's bring that out here and then come all the way. Actually, we're going to come to right here. And we are going to take our other giant bomb and we are going to put it right there. So now we got to build around that. Giant bombs are ridiculous now. Um, they do so much freaking damage, but I like to leave mine inside the walls because otherwise like one goblin can set off my giant bomb and it's going to be such a freaking waste. So that's why, uh, I design my, my bases like that when it comes to giant bombs and, and, and stuff like that. Go ahead and get this guy out here and now let's bring our other gold storage right in here. And let's bring our last archer tower right, come on, right there. All right, good. And let's build this around, build this down, grab this big guy, put him right up here. There we go. Build around him, come up, and then all the way down. There we go. And uh, yeah, now we're going to bring these walls in right there so we're going to section off the uh, I still got too many of these level 6 walls we're going to section that off and now we have to finish uh, with the rest of with the rest of everything so let's bring this cannon out again we're spreading them out around the base um, and then we're going to bring a gold storage I hate I hate this so much I hate having to, to put gold in gold in uh, Vulnerable places, but with trophy bases, that's what you got to do. You can't really do too much about it, and it sucks, but hey, you know what I mean? What are you going to do? You can't protect it all. You can try, but you can't. <laughs> so go ahead and try. All right, so there is that section right there. Come on, zoom out for me. Good job. You got it. And now let's bring down this last... Uh, cannon right here and our last gold storage and our last elixir storage and as you guys can see they're spread out all along the base um, so that I don't lose it all at one time because that would be unfortunate you know what I mean so they really have to deploy hard in order to get all of my uh, loot they're, they're gonna have to deploy pretty strong in order to do that um, now you guys might say hey Molt with just a couple wall breakers they can get into the center right here um, into your town hall. Well, that's why I have the town hall towards the back of it right there. Um, I think that's going to help it out a lot uh, when it comes to them breaking through the walls. Um, and I also have these points right here that if somebody drops wall breakers um, down here in this section, they're going to go and hit this wall right here. And then most likely they'll go towards one of these on the side instead of uh, straight down the middle. So we'll see how that works. Um, if not, then I can always tweak it to bring my mortar down to like right here and then build up walls right in there. But then that would just make my mortar a little bit more, uh, a little bit more vulnerable. Look at this glitch right here. I hate that it does this. Watch. See, now they're connected. Before they weren't. It's really weird. Um, 
So yeah, guys, this is pretty much the base. I have to finish uh, bringing everything out around uh, the base in order to save it. So let's go ahead and bring out these army camps. Um, there's one. Where are my other ones? Army camp. There we go. And army camp right there as well. What's going on over here? That was from before. All right, bring this guy out. Good. And then now we're just going to spread things out. Like I've always told you guys, you got to go. Uh, barrack, gold mine, barrack all the way around um, so that people can't just attack and get all of your resources at once or anything like that. So if you spread them out and don't just put them all on one side, then you'll end up a lot better off than if you put everything on one side where people can just take it all. Um, let's just throw this wall right there. Good. <laughs> little pink wall over there. Doing its thing. Spread these out there. Spell factory. Mine. Uh, builder's hut. Builder's hut. Builder's hut. Good. Oh, and we also have to put our traps in, so I will be doing that shortly as well. Um, let's do Dark Elixir Drill. Actually, we need to do Barrack right here to separate those, and then Dark Elixir Drill. <clears throat> We're running out of buildings to separate these with, so now I'm just going to start filling in spaces around the base. Um, yep. And yep. Nope. No, I didn't want the bomb. Dang it. All right, point up there. We'll put the bomb right there, okay? Um, I am putting my spring traps one and two right in here with these archers one and two because I believe that they're going to get attacked a lot. And then we're going to bring uh, some spring traps into the center for once the troops get in here. Put another bomb in here. And then we're going to go one and two two right there. I think my wife just got home. <laughs> so y'all might hear her come in the door. One and two. I'm going to close the door real quick. One and two right there. All right. And then let's um, finish spreading out. Where did I put those other air bombs? Um, let's do one right over here and then one right over here. There we go. And look at that Instagram guys follow me on Instagram if you want to see raids that I don't post on here because I do put up some pretty sweet raids sometimes that I don't post on here so uh, yeah that's where those are um, all right now let's let's move our bombs out and around uh, let's put another one right in there next to that and then another one right here as well and then bring uh, let's put a couple back here towards the top. And you know what, let's put our Santa Strike up here as well. And now I am just going to come down here. And, oh, why is that there? That's weird. All right, and let's put this guy right here. And now we're just going to do flags all along the side. I know this is boring for you guys, but I got to get rid of them in order to save it. <laughs> Can he go down further? Stop it. I need to get an iPad. That's what I need to do. All right, so we're just going to throw all these out here. Put the windmill right there. 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 Keep on bringing them out and around. Um, and then let's put our torches in here as well. Just to make those look cool. There we go. And then our flowers. I don't really care where these go right now. I'm just trying to get rid of all of them. <laughs> Flowers, flowers, and flowers there. So they're all out. I don't really care. So guys, there's the base right there. I think this is going to work really well. I'm excited about it. Hope that you guys are too. If you try it out, let me know how it works for you in the comments below. Um, and I will hopefully show you guys some reviews, uh, some reviews, some uh, base reviews of it working well. So I'm going to save this, guys. And uh, let's see, let's see how we can do with the trophies, all right? Uh, thanks a lot for watching, and as always, guys, make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me, alright? Oh no, low battery. I'll see you guys later.